Wow, dude, nice glasses. I love them. And I, I, I absolutely love what you did with your hair. What are those, wires? Guys, welcome back to another How to Train Your Monster. And today, we'll be facing this horrifying cyborg spider guy with our monster, Bridgeworm. Bridgeworm, how are you? Hello, you're looking awfully tiny. He's only a level one. As you know, we're starting with a baby Bridgeworm, but we are going to train him to fight this big mechanical monster guy. I don't know what kind of troubled past he has had, but something's going on here. He's got some kind of suction hand, one big claw hand, and everything about him scares me. I don't know what kind of upgrades we're gonna be looking at. We're gonna be making some big meaty hands. I can see that happening. When he fights, his face flap flips up, so I don't know. We're gonna have to get in there and, and, and do some, uh, I don't know, give him a manicure. <laughs> but we're gonna get right into it, guys. All right, we're gonna see you in the final battle. Get out of here. All right, thank you. We start at Stadium 4, we put down some basic monsters, and we work our way up all the while upgrading our bridge worm. I hope you guys do enjoy this. I know a lot of you guys have been saying you enjoy this series, so please leave a like for the How to Train Your Monster series, and don't forget to subscribe if you are not already, because we are going to be doing plenty more based on your guys' comments. So yeah, also leave a comment uh, letting me know who you want to see do battle next. Bridge worm, you ready? I got somebody for you. I got your first contestant, and it is, you guessed it, a big- a baby with a shotgun. A baby with a freaking double barrel shotgun. He's trained, all right? He's fresh out of the infantry. <laughs> oh God, why? It says they're from Mortal Kombat. I don't remember the baby from Mortal Kombat, but I guess there was one. All right, Bridgeworm. Now this is your first step to growing into a big strong man. Three, two, one, go. Here he goes and he's off. Oh God, one down. Oh, he's just like, <laughs> okay. Bye bye babies. All right, well, those babies didn't stand a chance. Who would have thought <laughs> that uh, little babies wouldn't be able to handle a gigantic or sorry a tiny monster tiny for now that is wow you're covered in baby blood that's not good uh i think it's time to step it up a notch but first of course we're gonna make you bigger bang oh yeah there he goes that's about double in size he's not quite yet the full size bridge worm but he's getting there how about attack helicopters with samurai swords <laughs> i didn't know i could actually give them katanas but it, it does work so before we move to stadium three bridge worm you're gonna have to get through these three attack helicopters with freaking katanas. It's, I know it's weird, but that's what we're doing. I'm actually very happy that this is working. <laughs> I, I've never seen anything like this before. And I hope you haven't either. I'm sure you haven't. If you have, uh, what, what, where, where do you go? <laughs> Three, two, one, and release. Get him. Okay, there he goes. There he goes. They don't know how to use them. They're, oh my God. You, and you're supposed to be attack helicopters. More like run a, run away helicopters, am I right? Wow, he bent them all up. <laughs> he actually twisted them. It just goes to show, attack helicopters don't know how to use samurai swords. Gonna have to write that one down, that's important. All right, you know what time it is. It's time to give you some big old beefy arms, all right? Like you've been hitting the gym. Here we go, let's see. Upper arm, left upper arm. How's that gonna do? Is that gonna, oh wait, that's this one, huh? Oh my God, yes, there we go. It's all natural guys there's no steroids here all right that's against the rules he's, he's been pumping a lot of iron there we go face those hands outward oh my god yes okay um something's a little off here hold on there we go okay is that evened out oh wow now he's uh <laughs> now he really does look spooky he kind of looks more like a ghost now okay who are we gonna fight i have these guys <laughs> apparently they are they're scientists. Guys, I don't have <laughs> a really nice tie. I don't know if these guys can handle them, but they look like they're ready to do some like high noon shoot off stuff. <laughs> Put in the old Western whistle. And here they go. Get them. <laughs> okay, well that, <laughs> that's a lot of blood. Guys, that one was just for fun. Uh, obviously those scientists. <laughs> They couldn't outthink that one. What about Bones? Old Bonesy. Wow, look at him. That looks like a, is that a gorilla skeleton or something? You know he has a TikTok. He makes TikTok videos. <laughs> all right, Bridgeworm, you gotta stop this guy. You gotta stop him. Stop him from making TikTok videos. All right, it's getting out of hand. He's ruining songs, and no one's no one can stop him except for you. Three, two, one, go! Here he goes, and he's in, and he's in. They're all oh my god, and they're all dead. Wow, he says, "Give me a hard one." Hold on, let me. Lap up this experience here. There we go. Yummy, yummy. I'm gonna level you up a little bit, but we're gonna give you a hard one before we move you to the next stadium, okay? All right, we're just, there we go. His flap's already off. Oh my God, he looks... 
Beautiful. You are handsome. What did you do with your makeup? <laughs> it's, I've got to learn your techniques. Get a couple magma demons in here. As, as backup, we'll give them two pirates. Yep, okay, we got two pirates and some magma demons. That should be, oh my, look at him. What is going on? Keep your eyes on him. Huh, get it? <laughs> keep, keep, okay, here we go. Three, two, one, and release. Release. Okay, he's going. He's going for magma demon. Um, he's killing, they are at negative health, but for some reason, they're still going. That can't be right, there's a glitch in the matrix. Okay, the, the magma demons are at negative health. Oh, I think he's actually stuck on them. Their bodies stick around, oh no, he, they still move when they're negative health. I guess that's part of being a demon. You just don't, don't oh, there you go, he got, that. oh, and he just ran through the pirate. And now, he seems to not know that the, yeah, uh, these guys are glitched out. That's that's what's going on here. Well, we'll count that as a win for sure. Even though the uh, the the demons were uh, cheating a little bit. Look at him. He can't even believe it. Look how surprised he is. Yeah, I can't believe they cheat either, dude. Let's move to stadium number two. Oh man, and you know we're gonna make you big now. We're gonna make you normal size. And bam! All right, and you <laughs> you only get prettier as you get bigger. Trust me, guy. You look great. You know, if if I were sitting like this with my eyeballs out, I would hope that somebody would do the same for me. And, and put my eyeballs back into my head. So we're gonna try and do that. All right, there we go. One eyeball in the socket. <laughs> you know what they say, one eyeball in the socket's worth two in the pocket. Wow, good enough. <laughs> okay, and for your next battle, I think, you know who I wanna bring out? Old Uncle Aglon. I just really like Aglon, I've gotta say. Something about him just, it, it, he brings me comfort, all right? <laughs> Something about his big brick hands. Three, two, one, go. Fight him! Get him! Oh my god! And a big hit from Uncle Aglon right down on the bridge worm. If you're, if you're not careful, bridge worm, he's gonna kind of squeeze you out like a tube of toothpaste. Alright? I don't even like that image. Okay? So don't let him do that, please. Get him with the flap. Get him with the flap. And those big hands are, are flapping around. That's why I made him big. He's somersaulting. Now's not the time for your gymnastics, Uncle Aglon. Oh, and he's dead. And he's dead. Oh, Uncle Aglon, why? All right, well, of course, defeating Uncle Aglon is an automatic level up. That's the good thing about him. He's kind of like a rare candy. We're just gonna go ahead and level you right up here, and I think what I gotta do is I gotta do something about your face. Oh, look, he's waving. Hey, Bridge Worm. <laughs> All right, well, now that he has this tremendous underbite, I'm sure he'll be able to not, he'll be able to uh, bulldoze them over. I don't know, clamp them down between his jaw and his top flap. He can get creative with it, guys. That's what I'm saying. These big hands, he's got a lot, <laughs> a lot to do. Wow, Bridgeworm, you, you are a good one for this. You really are. What about Braha? Bra oh, Braha and his big old belly. I, I really like him. He's one of my favorite monsters just because of his big stumpy fingers and his his sick piercings that he's got going on in his head. All right, you ready, Bridgeworm? I'm sure you can handle this. This is gonna be no problem. All right, three, two, one, release the monster. Go in, right for the, oh my, and he's tossing him around. He's, at, he's, he's running circles around him. He's going for the butt crack. No! All right, we've moved it. We, he's taking him over to Stadium 2. He says, you're not even worth Stadium 1. Oh, he's throwing him back to Stadium 1. I'm gonna hold him steady. <laughs> I'm gonna have to hold him still. Get him in the stitches, the weird belly stitches. Pull on his nipple piercings. I know it's not exactly fair fighting, but I mean, look at him. And he's going down. He's going down. Three, two, one. Dead. Absolutely destroyed. You didn't even stand a chance. And, you know, who who would, really, at this point? Uh, look at him. Well, you know what that means. It's time to move up to the grand stage and look at him. Look at his vic- It looks like he's, uh, he's proud of himself, really. He's cheering for victory. He's got his hands up in the air and everything. Okay, well, we're gonna have to go get you patched up. And actually, we're gonna reset you and just do the ultimate evolution of Bridgeworm, as we do on the grand stage. Alright, guys, it's time for the ultimate evolution, and the first thing we got to do, of course, is make him big. We gotta hit him with the old Midas Toucheroo. Where's your hitbox? There we go. He's a nice golden brown bridge worm. Now he kind of kind of looks like a turd. It's fine. It's fine. It's gold. All right. It's just hard to see under the moonlight. And move that flap. Up. Oh, I turned it upside down. Oh, now it's kind of like a sick hairdo. <laughs> Is it? It's the Elvis of bridge worms, guys. Oh my god. Oh, he's like a, sh a shark. His back end is like a hammerhead shark. Oh my god, there's a hammerhead shark coming my way. But little, little do you know, it's just a bridge worm with a tail fin. 
Okay, you're looking good. Now you'll be able to transfer smoothly from land to water whenever you need. Yep, all right, well, that'll do it. I guess I'll put in the boss here. Is there room for two of them on here? <laughs> I don't think this town's big enough for Bridgeworm and uh, this other boss guy I have. Hold on, I gotta find, uh, I gotta grab him. Okay, and then make him, oh God, now he's huge. Now they're both huge and they're just inside of each other. This is like the face-off before a UFC fight where they're all, they're taking pictures and they're weighing in and they're all up in each other's face. While they both have similar teeth, they they both have big long hands. I really don't know who's gonna win this fight, but I'll tell you what. Well, I do think that he has more health than Bridgeworm, although I cannot find out how much it is. All right, three, two, one, release. Here they go, and they're just bumping into each other. Oh my god, somebody's using magic. Last I checked, Bridgeworm didn't have magic, so I'm guessing that's Juggernaut. Some Hail Mary attacks here. He's going all out. I can't see- Oh, Juggernaut's now immune to something. That can't be good for Bridgeworm. <gasps> no! Bridgeworm, I can't leave you on a loss. So you know what? I'm gonna leave you in your somewhat normal state, gold, and I'm gonna put in somebody that, you know, not, not too weak or anything like that. Someone that is still a challenge but somebody that I hope we can end on a good note with. And it's gotta be the Grim Reaper himself. Bridgeworm, you just faced death and now you're gonna face him once more. Three, two, one, release. I don't know how this is gonna go because he's actually really strong. Um, <laughs> but you know, Bridgeworm might win because he's getting a lot of hits in and he's getting them in fast. Yeah, Bridgeworm's actually hanging in there. Yeah, I, I think I saw his health for a second. It's kind of hard to catch, but he's absolutely shredding through the Grim Reaper. He is having his second wind. Oh my god, and 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 the Grim Reaper's doing something. He's doing a thing. Maybe he's summoning Billy and Mandy. Oh, oh, lava move, lava move. Bridgeworm, are you okay? Oh my god, it's getting close. He's not... The Reaper seems to be invincible right now. He's in a temporary state of invincibility, which does not bode well for a Bridgeworm. Oh, oh god, there's some fire move. No, Bridgeworm, you got him so close. But your child lives on, Bridgeworm. Your child lives on to finish the job. The one that you started. Oh, Bridgeworm's actually, no, wait, wait, wait. Okay, his invincibility's gone now. Finally, he got rid of that stupid overpowered move. And he's dead. Oh my God, defeated by the child of Bridgeworm. It just goes to show you stuff. If you really, if you really level up your first one, the, the kid's gonna be even stronger. This Bridgeworm ha right here has the power of a level 99 Bridgeworm. And he's only gonna get stronger. You okay? No? <laughs> Guys, I hope you did enjoy this battle. That was a lot of fun. He was a really uh, strange one to upgrade, and uh, I'm looking forward to doing more like that. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like, and of course, I will see you all next time. Goodbye!